Hey guys, this is Kim from This Darn Chicks Designs. We're back in Canva again. Um, we are going to be looking at some actual designs here. Um, what I wanted to show you tonight is how to print on fabric. Now, everybody knows that when you go to the store now, um, if you're going to a fabric store, the fabric is very expensive. Sometimes you're paying anywhere from twelve ninety nine a yard to um, twenty dollars a yard, depending on whether it's an upholstered fabric or if it is a um, it could be a, a twill fabric, it could be a linen fabric. Linens are really expensive. Um, those are more like if you're making um, anything for like your table, like your table linens, things like that, curtains. Okay, most of the time we can't seem to find what we want anymore in the stores. So what I've been doing is I've been going and getting a couple yards of fabric that I think that I'll probably use later on. And I always get white, okay? White is like the, the very first thing that I always get because white you can print on. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to print your own design, okay? So you could download it from your SG printer or any other sublimation printer onto fabric. So you have multiple colors of fabric. So let's go ahead. We are going to create a design, okay? And here, I always put it under t-shirt and the reason why it just seems to be a little bit easier for me just to put it under the actual t-shirt itself. So we're gonna go up here to elements, okay? And this is in your Canva. And let's say we wanted to search for, let's say lemons, okay? All right, oh, be nice if I could spell, huh? All right, lemons. Okay, so in this panel over here to your, um, your left-hand side, you are going to get tons of different shapes, sizes of lemons. So you can kind of just kind of scroll down. Let's go ahead. And let's see here, let's let's pick out a couple of them to make your own little patterns. Sometimes these patterns are already made for you. So let's just take this one right here, okay? This is off of the, the pro version of it. Here's your lemons. Now what you could do is add more to it. So just kind of duplicate it a couple of times. And start making your pattern, your block. Now depending on let's depending on how your pattern is you just got to watch you know because sometimes it may not line up you definitely want it to line up so let's see here and you may have to like go ahead and just kind of turn it around patterns are really funny um they're to make um you have to make sure that everything lines up really well Let's pull this up here, see, and I don't know if you could see this or not, but you see where the leaves are at? If I move that down just a little bit, that brings my pattern off. So I wanna attach those two together. I'm gonna to go ahead and make another one, kind of pull it down here, and that right there has made my pattern. Now, I can also make another one here and kind of pull it over to the side if I want. Now that right there is going to show you that your pattern is going to go off the page, which is fine. Okay. Let's add a couple more. So let's kind of pull this pattern down here and this pattern here. So you want to kind of match those leaves up there. So now you've got yourself an actual printable pattern. Okay. That you can use on um, any white fabric. Now that being said, it could be cotton. It could be polyester. Most of the time though, if you're going to print, all right, you're going to want to print on 50% polyester, 50% cotton, okay? As long as it has that on your tags, you're fine, all right? Because that's going to actually embed into the actual fabric. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and upload this. We're going to share it, okay? Go down to my downloads, all right? Download this. It's also gonna show you, because I have it on a t-shirt design, what it would look like on a darker t-shirt. However, I'm not doing it with a t-shirt, so what we're gonna do is go over here, and under my untitled design, I'm going to actually put lemons. Okay, 
and then we're going to save that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead. We're going to get out of Canva here. And then we are going to go down here to my uploads because I'm going to wind up having to upload it. But let's go into my creative studio. Go ahead and sign in. Accept this. After a while, if you're in Creative Studio, um, sometimes it will actually go ahead and time out on you. So you got to kind of get back in. So let's go ahead and start creating. And we're going to go to our galleries and my image. Okay. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to upload because I have, I just now uploaded, I just now downloaded the lemons. So we're going to go to lemons open it up and right there's my pattern. Okay. That we just created on Canva. You want to save your pattern. Okay. Then you want to go to products, blank products. I always go into design canvas and then go down to, if I can find it here, eight and a half by 12. All right. And then we're going to add we're going to go right back to our galleries, okay, and pick out our picture that we just downloaded. So now we've got our lemons. Okay, make sure that this is actually inside those lines there. Okay, we don't want to go outside of that line. And this right here is what we're going to go ahead and download a print. So I'm going to go to my print. All right. We are going to go to letter size which I could do a, a one that's a little bit bigger if I wanted to, but just, I just wanted to show you what you could do with it for tonight. And I'm going to go into, we're just gonna go into uh, cotton, okay? All right, there's that one. Actually, let's go into polyester. And the reason why is because I can get vivid. Um, I can actually just get a really pretty vivid image for polyester. And we're gonna go ahead and print that. We're sending it now. It's gonna go to my saw grass. Press okay. Now, if you go into um, the store, okay, if you go into the fabric place, you're probably gonna pay about $12.99 just per, um, it depends on which store you actually you go into. I mean, you could go into Joann's, Walmart, whatever. Usually I just go into Joann's because I just go and get blank, um, which is white fabric, okay? Depending on if they've got sales. Sometimes they'll have sales. Um, you just kind of have to go from there. But you're probably going to pay for anywhere from like $12.99 on up now. Um, just because fabric's gotten so expensive. So this is my fabric. These are my lin uh, lemons that are here. I'm gonna go ahead and print this off and I'll show you exactly what it looks okay, like. Okay, so this is our print it, um, our print that actually came off, okay? Bunch of little lemons here. So we are going to go ahead and we're gonna press this onto polyester. This is 100% polyester, all right? It does have like a little film to the back of it. It's a it's a cotton back backing, uh, backing I'm sorry, can't talk tonight. Um, so this right here, I mean, you don't have to worry about bleed throughs or anything like that. However, you could also go ahead and print it on 50% polyester, 50% cotton. There's also linen that you can print it on. Okay. It just depends. Each fabric takes a different, um, different design. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this pattern in half. Okay, I'm going to show you what it's going to look like with each one, okay? So, we're going to use this very first one right here, all right, with our lemons in it. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to place it to the side here in case we want to use this other side, okay? Let's go ahead and get this out there. Always use your heat tape, Okay. You can get your heat taped over at Michael's, Joann's, Amazon, anything like that. You know, wherever you want to get your heat tape up. Okay. And so that one's that right there. Now your next piece is actually going to be on linen. 
So just go ahead and we're just going to, let's just cut a piece of linen here, okay? Because I want to show you the difference in how the ink takes. Oops. Okay, so we have three different ones. 100% polyester. There's your fabric on that one, okay? Those nice little pretty lemons, very vibrant and pretty. Like I said, this is 100% polyester, okay? Your next one is linen, okay? Now, a little bit lighter, all right? But it's still great for table napkins. Okay, we're gonna put this right next to it so you kind of know, you kind of see the difference between shades, okay? The next one here is polyester mix two, okay? And you see this one's even a little bit lighter. So there are differences in polyesters, okay? Um, this is a 100% polyester. This one right here is linen. This is 50% polyester and and um, and 50% cotton. So the more that you mix together on synthetics um, when it comes to uh, fabrics, different synthetic fabrics, each one of them are going to take something a little bit different. The design may be different, but the saturation is 100% different. Um, so always know that if you're going to do anything and you want a really, really rich base when it comes to um, colors on your fabric, you want to do the 100% uh, polyester. And also, there are grades of polyester. The more you pay for your polyester, the better you get, okay? The less you pay, the less saturation you're going to get on any print. So don't think of that as your print. It's mainly your fabric that you have. So this right here, I could probably go ahead and then do the back of it and make a little bag in it or whatever. But I can tell you that um, printing your own fabric definitely makes a difference. Um, think about like if you wanted to do something with like your iPad, if you like to draw, okay, take that drawing, download it, put it onto your SG, print it out, um, and then you've got your own fabric with your own drawing on it um, to make out uh, quilts and um, any type of sublimation or let's say for instance that you like to upholster and you want this actual fabric on onto one of your chairs. Guess what? You already got it. You made it. So if you like this, let me know. Um, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching tonight and you guys have a good night.